buckthorn is an invasive plant that can actually take over your yard if you let it. Reporter Sonia Goins goes in the garden to show us how to get rid of buckthorn for good. Buckthorn is a woody, small tree, large shrub that came from Europe and people planted it as a great hedge. It wasn't hard to spot buckthorn at Zachary Park in Plymouth. That's one and there's one just inside there. This is what it looks like close up. Dark green, kind of glossy and oily and the way the leaf pattern is. Plymouth crews have been working since spring to get rid of the problem plant. We've cleared about 45 acres since April. Buckthorn is bad because it's so aggressive. I have seen them this big around. Often taking over native vegetation. It's kind of like if you're running a race against someone on steroids. That's kind of like our native plants trying to compete against buckthorn. It's just not a fair race. The plant also reproduces quickly. There's like five seeds in each berry and each tree's got, you know, a thousand berries. There are several ways to make it go away. It's nice right now because the ground is pretty wet. You can pull it out. This is my preferred method because then you don't have any chemicals to worry about. You don't have to go check on it later to make sure that it's um, gone. Or you could bring out the big guns. It's called a extractigator. So I'm gonna take and put this right around the stem. I'm just gonna clamp it and then peel it out. I'm not putting forth a lot of effort here. You could also cut it off, but you have to add herbicides afterwards. 20% Roundup. If you just cut the plant and don't do an after treatment, it's just going to regrow and probably more vigorously than it was before. Buckthorn is not picky where it plants itself, so homeowners have to stay on top of it. It'll grow anywhere. Sun, shade, clay soil, sandy soils, it doesn't care. For In the Garden, Sonia Goins, 12 News. Plymouth is holding workshops to show residents how to identify and remove buckthorn. We have more information at our website. It's 12.tv.